I'm kind of confused. I think it is. Yeah, I, I think so. Right, okay, so that sets off all of those. Um... Okay. Fuck! Alright, cool. Okay, so now we're back in here. No. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, my health! Jesus. It's a lot. A lot. It rises a lot quicker than I thought. Jeez. It's one of those things where you're always going to... What is it? Set it off, which kind of sucks. Oh, really? The poison gas is already there. Crap, I thought I had to set it off. Oh, whatever. Crap. Oh dear. That could have been worse. Oh. So, with the stone basin. So it has the opportunity to melt both... I can't remember what it said. Metal or some other stuff. It, it did mention it, but I can't remember exactly. Yeah. Holy crap. So... <clears throat> yeah, I don't think I need to do anything with the stone basin. Oh. Crap. Going out of my way to not set off a trap. Aha! There you are! Hiding in the shadow, uh, shadows, a statue watches over the room. Gold flakes of metal mar the statue's wrist and neck, possibly indicating that some kind of adornment used to be there. There we go. Hallelujah. There's that. And the ne necklace. Ah! Of course. And also because I set off no traps, it should be safe to save here. Nope. Never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about. Remember me, oh! Alex. meant the most to me ever since ever since my parents died yes ever since they were killed you've been my little girl um yes that is oddly sinister little girl Ew. this isn't really happening Oh, so that was a hallucination. See, whenever it shows the cutscenes, I'm like, is this real or, or what? Oh my. Where am I? Uh, I'm not too sure. I mean, I can see where I am, it's just... Screw it. I'm assuming it's just regular old enemies. Doesn't sound like a horror, so it's all good. There we are. Cookery! Oh! Ooh, Leo! I am now enchanted. There they are. Where's the other one? Uh oh. Oh dear. I thought they exploded. That's where the other one went. It died. Oh, sh shite. Whatever. This magic is the worst. There we go, we got it. Through sheer brute force. Yeah! So, one thing I'm very curious about is what the hell... Yeah, that's the heal. So, what would happen... I'm at full health. 
real nasty. No, what would happen if I went to magic, spell list, did recover, and cast it with the alignment of Ulioth, because it's blue. Obviously the colour of it is, you know, the corresponding bar, red is hell, green is sanity, is blue magic? That recovers magic. That's bizarre. Oh, but it costs... Okay, but it's still... It can give you a fair bit. Yeah. Not bad. Alright. Wait. I just realised this room is actually safe now that I've killed everything. Yay! Awesome. Um, uh, Not a big fan of the camera angles. Yeah, some of them just... suck. Oh, great. Traps. Ow! Dick. What on earth? Oh, right. Oh, no. Dun, 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 dun. Ew, there's blood dripping down the wall. Oh, man. Fuck. There we go. Hey! Now for it. Here they all are! Hey, these are Manta Rock zombies. I don't really need to worry about them. Wow, well, I'm not even attacking. Oh, this thing doesn't have any arms. Oh! I was say, it's not really much of a threat now, is it? There we go. There's a cobweb! Alright. So, cobweb, archaeologist brush. Ooh! Out attack! Oh, right, yeah. Pick it up. Yay! Not bad. Oh, it's the mural! Wait a minute, that's changed, I'm pretty sure. The eroded mural appears to depict the arrival of a strange godlike entity before an ancient human tribe. Lindsay cannot recognize the god in the mural. He is mystified. Hmm. Either way. So what was that codec I picked up? Codex, even. Uh, runes. Tear. Ah, oh, okay. Summon. Ooh. I've almost gotten all the runes. Yeah. It would appear so. Alright. Either way. Hmm. I can barely... Oh, Christ. I can't see anything here. This kind of sucks. Yeah, slightly. No, it was arrow. I'm certain it was arrow attack. Hang on a minute. I may have already had the codex. Maybe. Rune. Do I have arrow attack or something? Oh, arrow attack. Creature. Oh, that's... I know which one that one is. It's crap. Yeah. It allows you to summon something. Basically. Yeah, I got the... I got the, um... The codex for it, I think. Shit. I can't see. Oh god. Oh, great. Oh, time to run! Ah! My health just continues to deteriorate. And I made it. Nice. Yes, my sanity can suffer, it's fine. Oh, there we go. They're attacking each other. Perfect! Wow, how? On the plus side, I could actually just run over here and do this. There 
go. Oh, that's how it works. If I hold down the right trigger and then pr press L, it counts as a half push trigger. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, there goes one. Now they all get their heads back. Come on. Fuck. Uh, I always manage to do that because I turn around. Whatever. Oh, wow. The headless one actually managed to hit this before it hit me. That worked out in my favour then. There we go. Yeah! Not bad. Holy crap. Alright. Either way. Great. I can get around this one though. Sucker! See, I like these ones because they're not so obvious. Uh, they're super obvious is what I mean. Oh shit. What is this? Nothing. Crap. That was a mistake. Every single time. That's what happens when you're in the middle of dying. Ah. There we go. Shoot, I've just realised. Okay, that worked. Never mind. Ah, I can't see. There you go. Hey, got a magical room. There, all dead. Holy crap. So, what was that one then? Tia. Oh. Oh, right. And there's a barrier there. Another mural. Also another dead zombie. A damage engraving on the wall depicts a skeletal demon befriending the ancient Khmer people. To Lindsay's eyes, the demon looks exactly like Paul Augustine's undisguised self. That's actually pious. Yes. Indeed. Either way, we uh, opened up the barrier. <clears throat> we can't be that far away from the end of the chapter, to be honest. I could be wrong, but I just assumed we can't be that far away. What did that do? I have no idea. Okay. Actually, wait, isn't this the room where... Oh god. No, it isn't... Ah, fuck. Isn't this where Elia was? And where she went to, to die? Yeah, I'm certain. Or at least we're getting, getting there. Oh, right. Okay. One down. Holy crap. Jesus Christ. Oh dear. Whatever. Wait. This is not Uliouth's zombies, because they're like blue. So I'm just kind of like assuming. What the hell is that thing doing? I can't tell if it's like attacking itself or not. Either way, we get another spell. Scroll of paper sits upon a ledge, circling the dais at the centre of the room. Summon Trapper. Oh! Okay. So now I have... My goodness. So, okay, we got Summon Trapper. Not bad. So I could summon a Trapper from Chaturga 
Ulias, and Zeldoth. Oh, isn't that cool? So it was Chaturga. Oh wait, it'd be Summon Creature. Summon... Where's Creature? Our attack. Oh, I just got that. I'm an idiot. It's our attack... Tear. Bad. Yeah, pretty cool. Alright, new spell. Do the same. I mostly do this because I want to hear what they sound like. Hmm. Okay. Oh! Oh god, I have to backtrack. I mean, I don't have to. It's more the fact I can backtrack. It's it. I think this is how you get the Manta Rock rune. Which would be worth it. But, god, I have to go really far. Christ. Shit. Oh. Oh dear. I'll just stand here and do this a bit. Alright. No, it was basically where the, s the statue said that it's... Ouch. Small enough for like a small bog to fit through, which would be what a trapper is. Like, a trapper would be considered as small as a dog. Oh my, that means I have to go really far. Yeah, maybe not. It might not be as far as I'm letting on, actually. The worst part is the fact I have to go back through all of these trap rooms, but... In fairness, they aren't terrible. Oh, I'm out of breath. Crap. There we go. Also, I'm not entirely sure how my sanity is doing, so... Oh god, so I'll just do a quiet... a, a nice... a nice little sanity recharge. Right. Fuck. Oh no! I'll just have to do a heal at the end of this. There we go, hit it. Woo! Heal me! I should also make a save. I will. At this door. Oh, because I ain't saved in a while. Uh, really? Never mind. I want to save, but the game won't let me. What a dick. Well, fuck. Most part about this is the fact the camera does not help. Ah, here we go. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is leading to it. It's a fair bit away, though. And yeah, I am getting more and more out of breath. There we go. Holy crap. I didn't actually know there was a stamina system. No, I thought I could just, you know, run as much as I wanted. Right, here we are. So now we're back at this. I'm trying to remember. Um, uh, whereabouts the... Manta Rock statue was? I think it was over here. I think. Ouch. Yes, here we go. Alright, so what I need to do is just go to my magic and summon a trapper. Basically. Holy crap. Um. So. I don't know how far I'd need to stand. So I don't know, will it screw me over? Either way, summon trapper. Don't think it really matters. So I summoned the trapper. So, after a trapper has been summoned, press A to trap an enemy when it's targeted using R. Press start to release the control of the trapper. They cannot open doors nor pick up items. Okay. Oh, it drains my sanity. Okay. 
Where am I? Oh. I think I need to be one that is good against them. I would guess. Maybe. Although I don't know if it matters. I'll try that again. My, the issue is going to be my sanity. Yeah. Can I run? Oh, I can run. Oh. There we go. Oh, there we are. And there it is. The Manta Rock Rune. Secreted inside the alcove, a rune awaits. Its energies silently are corroding the air about it. We got the magical rune. That is the rune. Oh, shit. That's the rune of Manta Rock. Uh, I'll just use the shotgun. Oh, got it. Easy. Also just use up a uh, quick magic heal spell. Makes no damn sense, but sure. I mean, we have that, but we don't have it entirely, I guess. Oh no! I still need a little bit more magic, I guess. Ah, fine. Alright, well. We got the rune. Hmm. Right, so we got the... The rune. Oh shit, the trapper! So... Lindsay spots a panel inset in the floor, circular in shape and with a linear runic design engraved upon it. So... I think if I use the brush on this... Oh god, I might have to get rid of all the enemies first. Shoot. Oh wait! No, there's a cobweb! I just noticed it. Yeah, I didn't actually need to look at that. There, cobweb. So what is this? There it is! Right, now we have access to it. Mental rock. So we've unlocked the power of Manta Rock's rune. Essentially. There it is. Manta Rock. So I can use that for basically anything. So if I did protect self. Oh my. Manta Rock. Ow. Either way, we're done. Hooray! So I got Manta Rock's room. What a trial and a half that was. Oh, shoot. I'm all tired. God. Wait, so... Wait, what would happen if I did recover Manta Rock? <gasps> oh my god, that recovers everything. Oh, that is the best. It costs a lot, but who cares? Alignment. Um, all right, the damage field. Damage field. Uh, it doesn't really matter. Um, I will have a quick... There, the enchant, enchant item. God, I can't talk. Sheesh. There we go. Enchant item. What would the other ones be? Reveal invisible. Damage field. Dispel magic. That's a... Like, barrier too. Yeah, whatever. Won't worry about the others. Nice! So, <laughs> worst part is now I have to go back through everything. Oh, fuck. Crap. There it is. I'm in! Cool. Phew! Yep, the, uh, Manta Rock rune is awesome. It allows me to, when I use Recover, it recovers everything. Except magic. Does... It requires a lot more magic too, but you know I can I can I can live with that. Right now I just have to get back through all this shit every fucking time. 
I mean, look at that. Like how much I need. Ho ho! Right on through. No, right. we're getting there. Although I still don't think the game's gonna let me save, is it? Nope. Oh, why? Why am I not safe? Ouch. Ouch. I'm just getting crushed by everything. I'm just getting hit by literally everything. Ooh, actually, wait. Yeah! Screw you, buddy. Fuck me. Just getting hit by everything. Alright, cool. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I don't have enough magic. What a surprise. Oh, crap. Shit. Ah, the poison gas. There you go. You give me that time now, but did you, bitch? Oh! I don't know if I like. Like, the Meta Rock Rune's cool, but oh god, using it for a recover's uh, like mana drain. Not so great. Wait a minute, can I go? Why won't you let me save? You prick. Okay. We're almost back to where I was. Almost. Shit. Uh, oh my god, I made a break for it, and it worked. Nice. There's still one left in here. Where are you? There you are. Yeah, screw you. Not what I wanted. Well, I can read that. I want to get a chance. I want, I want to finish this thing first. Finish him. Right, now I can look at the mural. Lindsay finds this mural frighteningly... Uh, frighteningly familiar. It is the scene he saw in the Tome of Eternal Darkness. The fertility god must be Manta Rock, and this temple must be its tomb. Uh, it is, actually. I mean, we've been here as Elia. There we go, I can save. I can finally. It's been a while. Yeah. Been a bit too long. Whoa. Oh. This is where Manta Rock dwelled. Still dwells. Oh god, it's actually gone even further than previous. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Hmm. The power of Mantarok is not easily controlled. What makes you think I want to control it? Arrogant man! Kill him! Make sure you succeed this time! Oh god. What? Whoa! The darkness shall prevail! Oh wow. Hmm? Now oh, we have to go behind Manta Rock again. Okay. Destroys the door. Oh, opens it. Interesting. So basically, Pius's entire mission is to summon Manta Rock. Seemingly, he wants to control it. But he can't, it seems. Oh no. That was Elia. Do not touch the heart, flesh, and bone, lest you become like me, a dead, rotted husk. Yeah, that's Elia. Oh no. I have waited many centuries for you. It was not easy hiding from the dark ones as they searched for me. At first they passed by, not thinking that the heart was inside my dead body. But I was forced to find refuge here. You must seal the heart so it never contacts your flesh and take it to the gathering of light. Take the heart there, or the world 
shall fall under a reign of eternal darkness. My. Oh, God. I mean, I kind of assumed Elia had died. What the? Whoa, what? Wait a minute. Oh! Demon in the Khmer. Alright. Okay, so now we know where the essence of Mentor Rock is. Hmm. Pretty cool. Oh. Whoa. Oh god, the camera's tilted. When the camera tilts, it means your sanity is bad. Oh god, she's real low on sanity. Yeah. To be fair, it's quite fun to have the sanity be low, because then you get to experience all the... the creepy bloody effects. Yeah, look at the... It's on a right tilt. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It's also a lot creepier, with your sanity super low, but... Yeah, it's fun. I was waiting for the door knocks then. Oh. Oh, yeah, we're not in the library, are we? Wait, what? Okay. Oh, oh. What? Okay, so what is this? Alex discovers a pulp novel written by one Dr. Edwin Lindsay. Among the books on the shelf, this is where the Tome of Eternal Darkness indicates that something of value was hidden behind this book. Yeah, look behind the book. It's... there it is. With the book removed, a secret cache is revealed. Inside is the heart of Manta Rock, encased in glass to protect the world from its corrosive energies. She sh should she claim the heart of... and it's darkness. The heart of Manta Rock. Yeah, sure. Yay, the essence of Manta Rock. Hooray. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. It was a fucking book. Ugh. God, the footsteps. Boom, boom. Christ almighty. Do not like the 